Russia conducted a test of a revolutionary nuclear-capable drone submarine that poses a major strategic threat to U.S. ports and harbors. U.S. intelligence agencies detected the test of the unmanned underwater vehicle, codenamed Canyon by the Pentagon, during its launch from a srv class submarine on November 27, said Pentagon officials familiar with reports of the test. No details were available about the location or results of the test. Pentagon spokesman Capt. Jeff Davis declined to comment, We closely monitor Russian underwater military developments, but we will not comment specifically about them, Davis said. Development of the new drone submarine was first disclosed by the Washington Free Beacon in September 2015 and then confirmed by the Russian military two months later. Russian officials said the secret program was mistakenly disclosed. U.S. intelligence agencies estimate the canyon's secret underwater drone will be equipped with Megaton-class warheads, the largest nuclear weapons in existence, with the killing power of millions of tons of TNT. According to a Russian document disclosed on state television November 10, 2015, the weapon is a self-propelled underwater craft capable of carrying a nuclear warhead up to 6,200 miles. The vehicle can submerge to a depth of 3,280 feet and travel at speeds of up to 56 knots. A drawing of the drone submarine shows it will be nuclear-powered, controlled by surface ships, and supported by a SRV submarine. Russia's SRV has been described in Russian press reports as a diesel-electric-powered vessel for testing new weapons and technology. It also has been described as an intelligence-gathering submarine. The Russian document said Russia planned to build a canyon prototype by 2019 and begin testing that year. The November 27 test indicates the document may have been a disinformation operation aimed at deceiving the United States about the program. U.S. intelligence agencies assess that the 2015 leak was Moscow's attempt to warn the United States about its displeasure with U.S. missile defenses in Europe and the deployment of missile defense ships to the region.